In this problem, we're told a ball is thrown horizontally from the top of a building. What will its vertical displacement be from the top of a building two seconds after it leaves your hand? So in this problem, what we're going to be solving for is basically delta y. So we can say delta y equals question mark. And so notice that we're solving for delta y. So we're going to be talking about, uh, in terms of this kinematic problem, we're going to be talking about the variables in the y direction. So what we need to do is basically solve for the y direction kinematic variables. So let's just start off with what we're given. So we know always in a problem where we have something falling, the acceleration in the y direction is going to be 9.8 meters per second squared. And so it's negative because it's going down. Uh, we're also given, right, we're trying to find uh, its vertical displacement from the top of the building two seconds after it leaves the hand. So it's going to go something like this. And then imagine two seconds passes. And we're trying to find its distance right here. So this is basically delta y. And so we know t equals two seconds. And then the key thing in this problem is they say the ball is thrown horizontally, meaning if something's thrown horizontally, there's going to be no uh, vertical velocity, right? So there's or the initial velocity, uh, velocity in the vertical direction is just zero. So we know v sub zero, y, and then we know t and we know a. And if we want to solve for delta y, uh, we can use this equation right here. So delta y equals v sub zero times t plus one half at squared. We're just going to plug in v sub zero. We're going to plug in t. And then we're going to plug in a. So just go ahead and plug it in. Notice that this is zero. So times t is just going to be zero. So it's really just one half times a, which is minus 9.8, and then times 2 squared. And so when you go ahead and do this, you're going to find delta y equals minus 19.6 meters. So if the change in y is minus 19.6 meters, that means it's basically going down 19.6 meters. So its vertical displacement is just going to be uh, right e, which is 19.6 meters. So uh, this is going to be your answer, and hopefully you found this useful.